Hi friends, good morning to one and all. In this video, we will see the determination of uh, diagonal elements when there is an addition of a link. So in the last class or in the last video, we have seen the determination of off diagonal elements when a link is added to the partial network. Now in this video, we will see the determination of diagonal elements when the link is added to partial network. Now if you observe, this is the partial network with the nodes 1, 2 and so on. And we, we know that already we have a link between the two existing buses P and Q. In between the two buses, in series to the link, we added a voltage source EL in such a way that the current through the element PQ is a zero that we have seen in our last video. Now what we are going to find is we are going to find the diagonal elements. In order to find the diagonal elements what we need to do can be observed from this performance equation of the matrices. So this is the performance equation of the matrices. In the left side you have all the voltages and this is the impedance matrix and this is the column of uh, column vector of currents. Now from this if I want to know ZLL value this is ZLL value. So what I need to do is I am just injecting a current of 1 ampere at the health node. So where is the health node? Health node is nothing but a fictitious or imaginary node between the nodes P and Q. I am injecting a current of 1 ampere at the health node. So if I inject a current of 1 ampere at the health load, making all the remaining currents as 0 up to this, what I will get? I will get E1 as Z1L into IL. So I got this equations like this. E1 as Z1L into IL. Similarly, E suffix P as ZPL into IL. E suffix Q as ZQL into IL and EL as ZLL into IL. Why I got these equations? Because I injected a current of 1 ampere only at the health bus making all the remaining currents as 0. So I got these equations. When I make IL is equal to 1 ampere I can get E1 as Z1L, EP as ZPL and EQ as ZQL. Similarly, if I make IL as 1 ampere I will get EL as ZLL. From this what we can understand is if I want to know the diagonal element ZLL I should know EL. Now in order to find EL or in order to find ZDL we again want to go for the primitive network equations. So <clears throat> as I injected 1 ampere at the health node the current from P to L IPL as this is the incoming current and these two are opposite in direction hence we will get IPL as minus 1 ampere and IPL is equal to we know this already from the performance equation of a primitive network matrix so IPL is equal to YPL PL into VPL what is meant by YPL PL it is the self admittance of the element which is in between the node P and node L Similarly, what is YPL rho sigma bar? It is a mutual admittance vector between the added element PL and the remaining elements of the partial network. So in this way, we got the performance equation which we have seen already in the previous videos many times. So now in this equation, if you substitute IPL value as minus 1, what I can get? So it is minus 1 equal to YPL PL VPL plus YPL rho sigma bar into V rho sigma bar. By this we can get VPL as this value. Now from this in the last class we observed that what is EL? EL is just the difference between these two voltages. So this voltage is EQ with respect to reference and this voltage is EL. So EL minus EQ is small EL. Hence I got small EL is equal to EL minus EQ. EL is equal to and how can I get this voltage from this voltage? It is EP minus this drop is equal to this. Hence 
EL is equal to EP minus VPL minus I just copied EQ as it is. This is the equation for EL. In this equation, I need to substitute VPL value, which I have determined here. But before substituting VPL value, we need to understand a thing. Why PL, PL is nothing but the added element between P and L. And between L and Q, there is no another admittance. Hence, the admittance between P and Q is same as the admittance between P and L. By this reason, we can say YPL PL is equal to YPQ PQ and YPL rho sigma bar as YPQ rho sigma bar. In this way, we can equate the element of PL with the element of uh, PQ. By substituting this and this in this equation, we will get the equation like this. In place of uh, EL, what I can substitute? ZLL. Hence, ZLL. In place of uh, EP, I can substitute ZPL. Because I injected a current of 1 ampere at Lth bus only. Making all the currents as 0. Hence, I can get EP as ZPL. And in place of VPL, here, I substituted this by replacing PL PL with the PQ PQ PL rho sigma bar with the PQ rho sigma bar and I get like this and it is ZQL in place of this V rho sigma bar as I wrote VQ, VPL as EP minus EL I can also write V rho sigma bar as Z rho L bar minus Z sigma L bar then the equation is converted like this. So in this way the equation is converted. So ZLL is equal to ZPL minus ZQL plus 1 plus YPQ rho sigma bar into in place of V rho sigma bar I substituted Z rho L bar minus Z sigma bar sigma L bar by YPQ PQ. So this is the final expression of the diagonal element when there is an addition of a link. Now we will see the special case in that. So the special case is when there is uh, no mutual impedance or mutual admittance uh, between the added element and the remaining elements of the partial network, I can make this term as zero. Because rho sigma bar is the remaining elements of the partial network and PQ is the added element. If the mutual impedance is zero, I can make this as zero. When I make this as zero, I will get only one by YPQ PQ. It is just the reciprocal of self admittance. Reciprocal of self admittance is self impedance. Hence, I can get the finalized equation for the special case with no mutual impedance or mutual admittance, which is ZLL is equal to ZPL minus ZQL plus small z PQ PQ. So in this video, we got the diagonal element of the temporarily modified Z bus matrix. In the last video, we got the off diagonal elements of temporarily modified Z bus matrix. So after this temporary modification, we will see how to evaluate sorry how to re-evaluate all the elements of the previous Zbus matrix in order to get the new matrix with the addition of a link so in the next video we will see that so thank you very much if you like this video please share and subscribe among your friends